नमस्ते गाइस वेलकम टू रेस्क्यू कोड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू सो इवन नंबर्स आर दोज नंबर्स व्हिच हैव पेयर्स एंड दे आर इजीली डिविजिबल बाय टू वी विल सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम बाय टू मेथड्स फर्स्ट मेथड देन इन फर्स्ट मेथड वी विल डू सिंपल इजी सॉल्यूशन so the solution hashtag include stdio dot void min program start and we have integer variable i and a equals to two now print f bracket quotation slash in the first 10 even numbers are slash n quotation bracket semicolon now we will run a loop a for loop for i equals to 1 i is less or equals to 10 and i plus plus now inside the loop we will print f bracket quotation person d slash t and a we will print a first even number is 2 so we will print 2 that is a means 2 bracket semicolon and after printing the first even number 2 uh, we have to print 4 right we have to make the value of a 4 so for this we will do here a equals to a plus 2 semicolon after printing the first uh, even number 2 we have to print 4 so we have done here a equals to a plus 2 that means a is 2 2 plus 2 will be 4 that means the value of a will be 4 in from next time so that was and now loop close and the program finish if we type this code then the result will be like this result the first 10 even numbers R colon and here is slash n so the cursor will move on the next line and we have printed a first that it will be 2 and here is slash t so there will be tab and then it will be printed 4 and tab and 6 and tab and 8 and it will go so on so now let's move on to the second method. so guys here is the second method solution hashtag include stdio dot h void main now program start and here we will declare a integer variable i and a constant integer variable count equals to one now we will print a message printf quotation bracket quotation slash in the first 10 even numbers are colon slash n bracket quotation bracket and semicolon and now we will run a loop for i equals to 1 and condition is count is lesser or equals to 10 i plus plus bracket and condition checking if if i percent 2 is equals to equals to 0 then printf bracket quotation 
person d person d slash t quotation comma i semicolon and count plus plus and if condition close and for loop close and this is your program close let's take a look first of all we have declared our integer variable i and a constant integer variable count equals to 1 and we have printed the message on the screen the first 10 even numbers are so let me explain this loop structure here we have i equals to 1 and count equals to also 1 now when the loop starts the condition will be checked if i percent 2 is equals to equals to 0 that means i is 1 and if it is perfectly divided by 2 equals to equals to 0 means if it is divided by 2 and the remainder comes 0 that means it is perfectly divided by 2 then this statement will be executed that means now i is 1 and if you if we divide 1 by 2 then the remainder will not be equal to 0 that means this is not an even number and thus this two statement will not be executed now again the uh, i increases and becomes 2 now i is 2 and count is 1 now if if we divide 2 that means i percent 2 if we divide 2 by 2 then the remainder becomes 0 and it becomes true so this statement will be executed now what is the statement here printf person d slash that means person d and i what is i 2 so 2 will be printed here and count plus plus now count becomes 2 and again the same process will same process will be repeated and again i becomes 3 i becomes 3 now see here again 3 percent 2 equals to equals to 0 if you divide 3 by 2 then the remainder will not be equals to 0 because if we divide 3 by 2 then that means remainder is 5 so it is not equals to equals to 0 that means this statement will not be executed and again the loop gets returned and i plus plus again i becomes 4 now and when i is 4 and again the condition will be checked and here 4 percent 2 equals to equals to 0 if we divide 4 by 2 then the remainder becomes 0 so again this statement will be executed and the statement is printf percent d i i is 4 so 4 will be printed and count plus plus count becomes 3 so by this way until the count is lesser equals to 10 this statement will be the same process will be executed and we will get our first 10 even numbers so on so by using these two ways you can find out you can display the first 10 even numbers so thank you guys for watching namaste